let's turn our data into a chart with Google Sheets. First thing I'm going to do is take my cursor and I want to select all of the information that I want to show up in my chart. And then I'm going to click on insert and I'm going to pick chart. So in this case, Google Sheets decided for me that um, it was going to pick a pie chart, which is okay. Um, let me just walk you through some of the different options for changing your pie chart. Okay. It'll automatically open up this chart editor over on the right hand side. Here is where you can change it. So it suggested a pie chart, which is okay in this case. Here are some other options too. Um, you can pick a bar chart or even in this case, a column chart might look okay. I'm going to leave it as pie chart for now. Um, and then I just want to walk you through a couple of the changes you can make to your chart. I'm coming over here to customize and chart style. Here's where I can give it some color. So if I want to maybe give it a nice colored background, I can also give it a border color. I can change my fonts if I want to change the way that looks so I can really personalize it there. And let's go into our pie chart options here. Here's just another spot where I could change um, some of the colors of the pie slices. Um, pay attention to this one here, the labels. Right now it has none. I can give it labels where I can have it show up the percentages or I can have it show up the values or percentages, just another way to um, put more information into your chart there. Under pie slices, this is another spot where I can change some of the colors. And then another thing I want you to pay attention to is the chart and axis title. So for the chart title, um, it automatically called it responses, which is not really a great title for this. This was class pets. So oh, I can give it a little more of an appropriate title there. And then if I had some axes labels, um, which I would with a bar chart, I don't actually have one on a pie chart, I would be able to change those axes titles as well there. And that is about it. That is the basics of creating a chart with Google Sheets.